Well, it's a beautiful sunny day here in Florida, and by Florida I mean Toronto, and by sunny I mean it's raining. But today I have a quick little tweak to show you off. I don't have much notifications on this iPad because I have no life. I do have a dog that likes destroying everything, but other than that, um, I'm just going to show you really quick what the new Vlox does, <laughs> if I can do it correctly without ruining everything. But basically you just swipe up and it gives you a quick little view into your application and what's going on. So it works pretty well and it works for notifications, it works for Cydia updates as well. It shows me the most recent tweaks that are coming out and you can go, you can check them out. And if you push it again, it'll take you to it. I'm not going to do that because I don't care about burst mode. Um, if you have a message notification, which I don't because I have no life, it'll show up right here. You can also change it so that it swipes down or left or right. I don't know why you would do that, but you can. Um, and it will fade in as appropriate as well, which is great. I don't do that because I like up because up makes the most sense. But you can mess around with a whole lot. And yeah, so you can search apps. I exited out of it because I'm an idiot, but it's relevant. I honestly haven't even actually used it that much other than to test things out. I've been told to test. So I don't really care too much for it, but it does a very good job what it does. I need to activate GPS and maps before I can use this. Anyway, um, yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, there's not a whole lot to it. It does some cool stuff, and it's written very, very well. Thank you guys very much, and this is a really simple video. Look at this guy.